All right, bit of a different video this week. Basically, my car's currently in the process of being vinyl wrapped this color. So while we wait for that unveiling, today, I'm unboxing something very exciting. In November last year, Tesla unveiled Tesla Tequila. Tesla like to do these kind of limited edition random item drops every so often. So they did a pair of shorts like a year ago, and then they dropped this very pretty looking Tesla Tequila bottle that is actually full of a very posh tequila as well. But that, is not what I'm unboxing inside of this box. Basically, because I'm in the UK, they weren't allowed to actually sell the alcohol, but what they were able to sell was the empty glass bottle. <laughs> so the original tequila was available in the US for $250. You know, it's very, very expensive. And then the empty tequila decanter was available in the UK for £130. Now I'm actually gonna treat this as a complimentary award that Tesla sent me to say thank you for surpassing an incredible 200 Tesla referrals. But in reality, I've spent £130 on a glass bottle that arrived five months after I ordered it and Tesla haven't sent me anything, even though they used to give away £250,000 Tesla Roadsters for people that surpassed 50 referrals. <clears throat> so let's open it up. This is going to be a lot of fun. Here we go. <laughs> All right, let me know in the comments down below. Do you want to see more unboxings on this channel? Because we don't always have to be fanning about with the car itself. We could do stuff related to Tesla and other electric vehicles in general. Okay, what we got so far? Oh, I think we have a pretty looking box. So let me grab that. There we go. All right, you ready for this? You ready? Boom. <laughs> oh, now to be fair, that's a pretty looking Tesla box. I like it. Look at that, it says Tesla, and it's got the Tesla logo, and it's kind of shiny as well. So now we simply slide this up, and we've got a bit of form. I like a bit of form. Remember, I spent £130 on this. That's kind of ridiculous, you know. That's expensive. It's a glass bottle. There is no alcohol inside of it. But the decanters are now out of stock, and as far as I know, they were limited edition, so they're not coming back in stock. When you search up Tesla tequila on eBay, there are actually quite a lot of people selling their tequilas and selling their decanters as well, and you can see that they're trying to get kind of a profit on them. I don't know how many are actually selling, though, but there are loads up for sale than more than the purchase price and you know it is a cool product it would be cooler if it actually had alcohol in it but it doesn't it's just it's just a glass bottle but you could fill it up with whatever you want anyway here we go it looks nice it, 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 i've just had a little glance at it. it it looks nice i can't wait to unbox my 200 referral awards that tesla very generously sent me let's have a look oh do you know what i like this quite a lot i, I really like the look of this all right let's pull it out Look at that. Obviously, it's complete glass. Listen to this. Oh. Oh my god, look at my face. Oh, that is astounding. <laughs> and then I actually like the shape that's left in the foam box as well. And then we've obviously got a metal stand. You want to hope it's bloody metal. Oh, that is sharp. You could cut yourself on these corners, but yeah. That is complete metal. And then the Tesla logo is on the side as well. So hopefully you can see, but there are a few kind of tiny little imperfections on the glass, but I don't think that's particularly a bad thing. I guess that's kind of just to be expected because you know, it's been blown into this shape. And then the actual Tesla logo is like a really nice gold on there as well. And then this should be a lid that we can unscrew. Oh, sounds like a pirate. Listen to that noise. Oh, let me screw it back in without scratching it. All right, you ready, you ready? Oh. <laughs> so now I can fill this with whatever I please, and then it's just a it's nice little drink to have by my desk, to be fair. Imagine how obnoxious I just make this my, my normal water bottle. <laughs> okay, we need to actually put this thing on its stand. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna just polish the stand, as I've got some kind of grubby marks on it, you can see. And then we place it down like that. Plunk this fella on top. Oh. And then obviously, if you were to put it that way, it would kind of be at the wrong angle. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, like that. It is cool looking, isn't it? I do, I do like the look of it. I think it's ridiculously expensive, but, you know, it's limited edition or whatever. I don't know how many they did. I don't think they announced that, but it does still feel very expensive. All right, put the lid on. And there we go. Oh, I put it the wrong way around. <laughs> what happens if you shine a light through it? Oh, not much, to be honest. Right, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fill it with what? Oh my God. I'm gonna fill it with water and see what that looks like. <laughs> Yes, here we go. Wash it out a bit. Listen to that noise, I like the noises. Oh, here we go. <laughs> so now we get to test. Is it actually airtight? Whack the lid on. I feel like it won't be airtight, but I guess we'll see. All right, you ready? Uh, uh, oh, it is 
is air tight. There's some water coming off there, but that's just the outside that's wet. Ah! Yeah, we're okay. We're all right. It is actually air tight. Didn't expect that. And there we have it. Tesla tequila. It definitely looks cooler now it's full of a liquid. Let me do the torch test again as well. I don't know what I'm expecting from the torch test, but I'm disappointed every time. <laughs> Well, there we have it. Got my new office water bottle anyway, so just, you know, whenever I feel a bit dehydrated, I just pop the lid and... Very nice. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, there you go. A little extra video this week. Hopefully they enjoy it. I'll try and get my hands on more Tesla stuff like this, because they are quite fun little videos. Potentially, this time next week on the channel, I'll be unveiling my pink Tesla. But it could be the week after. It depends when Don't Subscribe reaches a million. So subscribe to Don't Subscribe. The link is in the description. Alright, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Cheers. <laughs>